Okay, for everybody that is still here and curious to see this boa, um, she is a 2017 female that is a hypo possible het tannery. And the boy we have, ooh, this is a nice heat pack. <clears throat> Sorry. And the boy we have is a cherry hypo, oh, another heat pack. Very well packed. Good on you, Jason. Good on you. Um, the boy we have is a cherry hypo pastel het Oh, I'm um, sorry. Jungle, possible Aztec, if he is, it's probably very low expression, and possible Anery. So, oh my goodness, you're heavy, girl. Oh my gosh. What a big noodle. Okay. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's get, let's get into this. Okay, so <laughs> I've gotten boas before decently sized, like over a year old, from Jason, and uh, the first one I got was specifically from Temperament, although he did warn me about the other one I got from him, and I was told he was very spicy, but I was usually able to read their body language pretty well, so I have not really been bitten by a boa constrictor. I have been bitten by my Brazilian rainbow boa. Um, oh, hi, sweetie. She is ready to be out of here. This is a pillowcase. <laughs> Oh my goodness, you are gorgeous. <gasps> You're so big. Oh my goodness, this will be my biggest personal snake. Oh, we have so many plans for you. Pretty girl, you need to get your head out. Okay, let me uh, support her with my body. Ugh. She's stuck. Uh, come on. Oh, there you go. Hi. Hi. It's not food time. I don't have food. I was told that she has a pretty amazing, oh man, she's all over the place. Pretty amazing feeding response. She's never bitten anyone. Oh, oh okay. And people are scared of snakes. Are you all right, pretty girl? Um, I was told she's due for a feeding though, so we're gonna be getting her some food. She's definitely not as mellow as Sunset, but holy moly, all right, you're not that big. I, for some reason, thought you would be a lot bigger um, oh, that's underneath me. Hey, it's okay, pretty girl. Oh, you are beautiful. I'll get you some food. But, <laughs> yeah, so I still don't have a name for her. Um, I was told to be gentle. Um, no sudden quick movements, because uh, I guess that's kind of what food does. Um, she doesn't seem to be too used to handling, but this is mostly just curious behavior. She's checking the world out, trying to move, and I'm not restricting her in any way. I'm just trying to support her body and guide her while moving her around. And uh, let me just briefly reiterate, this is the biggest snake I have personally ever handled. <laughs> um, and this is okay. This is not bad. Um, I think that boa constrictors, um, especially, specifically BCIs, make amazing pets. Even first-time pets, if you're willing to work with their size and if you can afford the rats, because rats are... Oh, I'm sorry, sweetie. I'm sorry. Rats are more expensive than mice. Um, this is going to be very exciting. I've got to go and put her away, but thanks for watching, guys. I hope you have a great day. <laughs> oh, f Okay. Oh, Okay. <sighs> alright, alright, alright. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Oh. Um. Well. Oh, okay. Sweet, pretty girl. Um. You know. I was kind of having a feeling that was going to happen. That's kind of my luck. Um. But, like I said, easy to read that body language. I want to kind of get a better grip on her. I don't want her to bite me, but I'd also, she doesn't seem comfortable right now. Um, I'm not even sure if this is a food response. Pretty girl, what are you doing? Ah, oh, snap. Okay. So, like I said, um, I was told 
She has a pretty strong food response. I'm probably going to be re-watching the video and making sure that I didn't do anything. Um, if I did, I will be analyzing that. Okay, I see you're squeezing me, which makes me think this is a food response. Hi, are you okay? It's okay, pretty girl. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I spooked you. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's okay. You're okay. 